Dear participant, I am François Alfonsi, and this is my colleague Andreas Skider. We are two of the three co-chairs of the Kurdish Friendship Group in the European Parliament. The Kurdish Friendship Group is constantly working with our colleagues in the European, European Parliament, with Commission officials and with those involved in the European foreign policy to address the worrying situation of Kurdish people in the Middle East and to work together on solutions. The instability in the Middle East generates not only a global threat to peace, but also to security in the world. Uh, this was clearly shown during the terrible period in which the Islamist state has dominated parts of Syria and Iraq. Today, the Middle East is looking for a new stability and a new project for its future. We are convinced that the Kurdish people can play a central and important role in building a more democratic future in fraternal coexistence with the Arab population and the other people of the region. Tomorrow's Middle East must be home for a pluralistic society in which different communities can live in peace and quiet and where all cultural and religious minorities and their rights are, are protected. Where democracy, freedom of expression and freedom of press are uh, respected and women are re recognized as an equal part of society. What does it take to achieve these goals? It takes cooperation, mutual respect and the will to change something. We, who are allowed to live in the European Union, where there have been no armed conflicts or wars for over half a century, also want to support the countries and the people in the Middle East in achieving this. To live in peace and security without fear, without hatred and without armed conflicts. The current sanitary conditions, unfortunately, do not allow us to come uh, to your Congress in Baghdad, which we deeply regret. Nevertheless, we are and we will be at your side to contribute with you to a safe, peaceful and democratic future in the Middle East. We wish you a productive and successful conference.